Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Gulfstream Park here on Sunday. It is the 15th of January, 2023. Gonna look at the eighth race from Gulfstream, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5 for more selections for race courses around the world. The eighth race from Gulfstream, it's an allowance optional claim or purse $86,000. Race for Phillies and Mayors, four year olds and upwards, never won 12,000 once the main claim starter, restricted race, or it's never won two races here. Claim price of optional claim price of 25,000. Field of eight horses stepping to the Goldstream Park turf course. The distance of ground here of, of 1,000 meters, or the distance of ground of five furlongs in the Goldstream Park turf course. 1,000 meters, five furlongs here. And I showed the diagram. It just gives me a second to look down my notes. Just bear with me. Sorry, I'm stupid. I can't do two things at the same time. My top selection here, I'm going to go with the number five horse, um, Fire and Spice. I'm going to go 5417 in the Superfecta. 5417 Super. Top selection of five horse, Fire and Spice. Four year old by Uncaptured. Christopher Davis trains this one. Jose Ortiz gets the mount. The horse's most recent appearance came the 18th of December here at Gulfstream. Five furlongs off the turf on the Tapita and optional 25 Claimer. He finished second by two two lengths that day and he didn't have the best beginnings that day he, he got bumped out of the gate had to steady to take up position that day was wide but was closing up well late First off the bench, maybe need the race also, but coming here second off the bench, not the world's toughest race. You should get a good trip, and I think he could win here today. Two back ran the 16th of April here at Goldstream. Five prongs off the turf again on the Tapita and off to 25. To finish second by three quarters in length that day, and again, he was with them early on, a little bit wide, but was gaining late. Not the world's worst race for him there. And then a state bred allowance race here at Goldstream last season, five and a half on the Tapita. He won by five and a half lengths, and from a tracking position, he found good... Um, a good turn of foot, and he got the job done. A very good race with Jose Ortiz up, and then prior to that, at Goldstream, five rungs on the Tapita and allowance race. Um, he finished second by half a length, but again, it was a little bit wide, but was gaining late. Refreshing here, second off the bench, training very well in the Palm Meadows turf course. I'm going to give him a shot. I think your second likeliest winner is the four horse here, Fulminate. Ful Fulminate. Uh, Mark Cassidy trains his four-year-old uh, Philly by Got Stormy. Uh, Joe Rosario gets the mount. Um, most recently, uh, ran in the Southern California at Del Mar. Five frogs and a claim of 25 under the care of Peter Miller. One by three quarters in length from a wide poster. I got bumped early on, but after that, it was clear sailing. Quickened up nicely. 57-3 and three for the five. I thought it was a very good race there. Prior to that, and claimed 40 at Santinito over the six for lungs on the lawn. He finished fifth by three and three quarter lengths that day. He had a lot of speed early on, which cost him. He just couldn't keep up late. It wasn't the day to win. And then before that, low sal and a five and a half optional 40 on the dirt. He didn't. He wasn't handling the dirt. Coming back to South Florida, where he's three for three on this turf course. Um, one here in May quite nicely by two and a quarter lengths, flying over five. Before that one in April, very nicely over the five here. Um, has a lot of speed. I'm going to give him a shot here at 7-2 because it wouldn't surprise me if he gets the job done but to recap my selection for the eighth from gold stream let's take the fire the five horse fire and spice give kudos to the four horse fulminate five four one seven super five four in your multi-race so good luck to all please follow me on twitter at horse racing kid five good luck everybody